School, welcome to Moody High School TV Station. I'm Candice G. Here is Moody High School News. Question number one. What? What will be on MHN Moody High News? It could be anything, any person, any time in Moody High School. Anything worth reporting. It could be in the gym. It could be a basketball game, and it could be any big school event happening in the gym. It can also be in the classroom. Any interesting classroom activities and projects, and also experiments. And it could be out of the school. It could be any away sports games, field trip, or and we can see how our school students performing in other academic competitions. Question number two, why? Why do we need MHN Moody High News? To bring new understanding to the way we hear and see announcements and news while keeping our students and teachers informed about what's going on in our school and community. How? How can you watch Moody High News? You can tune in during second block during the second semester or you can click the link from our high school website that will take you to the news site. Bring news from you to you. We are looking forward to your support. Minimum wage! Hello, Moody High. Welcome to the new weekly show, The Weekly Show, with yours truly, Cody Lunsford. Um, it's our very first episode, so we've got a lot of good things planned. We have Victoria Dillashaw and Austin Epperson from the Christmas play that's coming on very soon. Yeah, really cool. We also have our very first musical guest, really cool guy, Jay Freeman. He's, yeah, he's introducing a new song. So uh, we're in a very interesting time here at school. I mean, don't you think? We're, uh, we're kind of in the middle between two breaks. I, I like to call this the, the meat, because like the other, the other two were like buns, and now we're in hard stuff. Yeah, it, it didn't make any sense on paper either. Um, but yeah, it's also a very exciting time in the entertainment world. The new Harry Potter movie just came out. Yeah! I saw it. Pretty brilliant. Um, also this Christmas we have you know, loads of good movies coming out, including Tron Legacy and True Grit. Um, but the movie that I'm most excited about is The Fighter, and it stars Christian Bell and Mark Wahlberg. Now, I don't know too much about this movie, I've just seen the trailer, but from what I can tell of it, the story goes a little something like this. Mark Wahlberg is like, yo, I want to fight, I just want to fight people, and Christian Bell is like, Okay, I'm your brother, and I'm going to prison, but I guess I'll help you. And then Mark Wahlberg is like, yeah, that's cool. Hey, let's just show some random scenes. Oh, look, there's Amy Adams. Say hey to your mother for me, all right? And Christian Bell is like, yeah, that's it. So um, so movies are a very good, you know, very good for this Christmas season. Um, in other entertainment news, Kesha, K dollar sign ha, has released her new album. It's called Cannibal. So obviously, in addition to being a partier, she also eats people. I wonder if she feels like P. Diddy when she does it. Um, another album release is Justin Bieber's acoustic album. Yeah, there's no joke for that one. That one speaks for itself. Um, also released is Kanye West's My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy. 
Now, I don't know if I'm the only one who was hoping for it, but I was kind of hoping Taylor Swift would have a, have a song on it. I was imagining Kanye rapping and him being like, I'ma let you finish. And Taylor Swift being like, ah, but n ah, n ah, ah, mm, for the chorus. I thought it, I thought it would have been good. So um, we're going to start things off real soon here. Uh, we have our first guest, Victoria Dillashaw and Austin Epperson. <laughs> yeah. Oh, got it on the <laughs> Ah, so you are in the Christmas play that is being produced at our school. What is the name of that Christmas play? It is called uh, The Little Town of Christmas. It's um, not really like one major play. Mm -hmm. It's uh, a Christmas variety show. So there's ten different scenes, okay. ten different skits, uh, all having to do with Christmas. And it's a comedy show, so it's going to Oh, comedy. I love yeah. comedy. <laughs> um, okay, so Victoria, what part do you play? I play Miss Claus. Mm -hmm. And, um... Yes, I read letters from children who send me letters during the Christmas season. And wise who complain about their letters. And wise who complain about their letters. <laughs> yes. Uh, Austin, what's your role in this? Um, I have actually a whole bunch of different roles oh, in okay. here. Uh, I'm in the very first scene called uh, Twas the Night Before Christmas, and I play a newsman who interrupts the show of, the, of Twas the Night Before Christmas. Yeah. And uh, so it's a very twisted version of that. And then... <laughs> yeah. And then um, me and this other girl, Candace G. Yes, we, uh, we know Candace. <laughs> um, me and her are in a scene called Santa's Pop Quiz, and mm -hmm. I play uh, Santa Claus who like rings the bell, collects money, mm -hmm. whatnot, and she plays a little kid who comes and annoys the stew out of me. <laughs> so like, get me to answer all of her questions to see if I'm the real Santa Claus or not. Okay, yes. So, um, so do y'all feel like this was a hard role to prepare for? Like, I mean, did you have to like study real hard or was it like easy? Well, we have a wonderful theater teacher and mm -hmm. she taught us how to improv. Right. And um, so even if you did have kind of a hard time, it was a very smooth transition and you just read over your part and then she would say, okay, well, if this part's bothering you, come up with a move or something mm -hmm. that helps you remember it. Right. So, truthfully, I don't think it was good. Bad. Yeah, cool. Um, I've been told that it is y'all's final grade in that class. Would y'all have been in this play, you know, regardless whether or not it was your grade, or would you have been on it regardless because it was, you know, fun? Me personally, I love acting. Mm -hmm. And so, even if I knew that it was our final grade, or if I, so I knew it wasn't, then I would still be in there. But um, it's a good thing that it is our final grade because if we don't, we have to take a written test and she says right. no one has ever passed it. Wow. <laughs> so uh, so uh, we're going to cut to a real short commercial break, but when we get back, we'll have more questions for these lovely people. Give them another round of applause. <laughs> okay, okay, welcome back to the weekly show. Um, we have with us our guests, Victoria Delashaw and Austin Epperson. We've been chatting it up about the play that they're in. Um, so tell me, guys, what is your favorite thing about acting? Oh, well, I think for me the best thing about acting is that you get to explore new characters. Uh, you get to really study like how different people act besides just yourself because right. you get kind of bored just playing yourself yeah. over and over again. So it's just kind of fun to like be something different. Uh, mm -hmm but on stage, not in real life. Be yourself in real life. Right. Um, yes. So who is your favorite actor? My favorite actor? Johnny Depp, obviously. Okay. I mean, the roles that he plays are just so different all the time, and he acts just so well, and it's mm -hmm. just incredible. Yeah. Um, Victoria, who's your favorite actress? I would have to say my favorite actress is Pamela Anderson. Why? She's just so inspiring. Sure, yeah. <laughs> Um, okay, um, so uh, let's see, uh, we're almost running out of time. Um, can you give us three good reasons we all should go see this play? Well, first off, um, it's got a life lesson to it, like in there, mm -hmm. and it's very humorous. Right. Two for you. Uh, okay, one more. There's two. Uh, third reason, probably because tickets are cheap. Yeah, I love cheap things. Um, okay, when is, when is the play? Tell us when it is. The play is today during the fourth block, um, and, and we also have a second performance uh, tonight at 7 o'clock. Okay, so. well, 
And it would be best to go to both, right? Because oh, yeah. productions are never quite the same. Two in a row. Exactly. Oh, yeah. You have got to make it to both shows. <laughs> okay. Well, um, all right. Well, we're out of time, so it's very good to have y'all here. It's um, very good to be here. Yes. Um, come to the show today during fourth block and tonight at seven o'clock. And right now, we are going to show some segments that me and my friend Jay Freeman did, trying to find out what the students of Moody High do in the hallway. Here's some clips.